Welcome to Dad Talk Network. If you're new to the channel, please like, subscribe, or leave a comment. Today, I am back in the kitchen with my wife, Tracy, and we'll be making a new dish. So Tracy, what will we be making today? Today, we're gonna to make a Mexican lasagna. I know that everyone is used to the Italian style lasagna with pasta and sauce and ricotta cheese. Uh, but this one is a little bit different uh, flair on it. It's a, a Mexican style lasagna. All the ingredients that you would put in a, a taco, uh, you would put it inside of the lasagna and using uh, burrito tortillas. Uh, so looking forward to showing you how I make Mexican lasagna. The ingredients and the equipment used, uh, when you assemble the lasagna, you're going to need six of the tortillas, flour tortillas. Now these are the larger ones. If you use the smaller ones, then you'll need 12. Uh, three to four cups of uh, Mexican blend cheese. Uh, three cups is the normal recipe, but if you like yours real cheesy, you can do an extra cup. Uh, and if your pan allows the space to put the extra cheese. And then a nice casserole um, dish, nine by 13 and um, a piece of foil to cover. We'll start by heating the skillet on high to medium high heat. Get the skillet nice and hot. I will now add the uh, taco seasoning. Mix that in thoroughly. And once you have that mixed, and you know anytime you add, use taco seasoning, it has a thickening agent in it. So you will need to add something that has a water content. So we're gonna use salsa. Two cups of salsa. Enchilada sauce, this is again a, a 10 ounce can. And this will make the uh, Mexican lasagna keep it nice and moist so it doesn't dry out. Next we'll add the uh, green chilies. Again, this is four ounces of green chilies and in, from the can. You can find these canned chilies where you buy your taco kits and your taco sauce. And then I'll add the uh, 10 ounces of black bean. And of sweet kernel corn. Gives that Mexican lasagna a nice uh, dimension with the corn added in there with the meat. And then you have that, that sweet flavor. This will layer up rather nicely with the um, Mexican cheese so that you'll get a get nice melty uh, layers in your lasagna. Okay. Just making the uh, meat mixture. And uh, I'll now assemble the uh, Mexican lasagna. Uh, first, I'll start out with uh, the meat mixture, and then I'll do a layer of cheese. Then I'll do the um, the tortilla, and then repeat, making sure that I end with a layer of cheese on the top.
you have it. Mexican lasagna, neatly assembled with the cheese on the top. Now I preheated the oven 400 degrees uh, prior to beginning my preparation so that the oven is nice and hot before I um, put the, um, the lasagna in there. Uh, so it will bake for 20 minutes with an aluminum foil cover. And then after 20 minutes, you remove the foil cover and let bake for another 15 minutes. Make sure you put it in the center of the oven so that it properly and evenly cooks. Okay, so now we have this delicious Mexican lasagna coming out of the oven. You wanna let this sit and cool for about 15 minutes. Um, you don't wanna uh, cut it while it's uh, this hot. So you wanna let this cool a bit so that you can cut um, nice, uh, even you know, squares and, and, and portion sizes out of, out of this without it breaking apart. Bon appétit.